Welcome to an emergency lighting design video from ABB Emerge Light. We work with a wide range of consultants, contractors and even end users to design emergency lighting to comply with all the relevant standards. Our projects range from simple offices to multi-million pound installations. We'll be looking at BS5266, which is a British standard for emergency lighting design for commercial buildings. There are two main options when it comes to backup power. A central power system, or self-contained. For a central power system, also known as a static inverter, or a CBU, all the power is kept in a single location, somewhere suitable like a plant room, for example. In this scenario, we can even use some of our mains lighting in emergency at full output without making any modifications. Looking inside our MX central power system, you can see all the components are housed together. Typically, the lead acid batteries here have a design life of 10 years, but we can use NICAD batteries to increase that to 25 years if it's required. This particular system comes with the optional touchscreen to provide fully automatic testing. Because the maintenance for a central power system is all in one location, this can reduce the running costs, which means in the long run, it can be a more cost-effective solution. For small to medium-sized installations, a self-contained solution may be more suitable. Emergilite provide a wide range of self-contained products, and with this option, there's no central power supply. The luminaires are modified and have all the relevant components like the batteries inside. Due to spacing limitations, the light output from a self-contained product is limited. Typically, for self-contained products on the market, the batteries need to be replaced every three to five years, which can mean high maintenance costs. Hopefully you found this useful. For further information, please visit our website.